video scribe tutorial. Is it the best video animation software or is it better than Doodly at all? Hi guys, in this video, I'm going to be answering all of these questions and I'm going to be telling you which software is going to be the best for your personal or for your business use. So firstly, I want you to come on to videoscribe.co. So once you come on to videoscribe.co, you will see this dashboard in front of you. Now simply click on free trial. And then after that, simply sign up with your first name, last name, email address, and then simply put in your password. And I'm going to catch you guys in just a second once I sign up myself. So once you've signed up, they will basically give you access to your free trial account. And then after that, you can basically like, you know, just simply download this particular application onto your Windows device and watch this video if you want to like get started with your guide as well. So like I'm going to install this quickly and then I'll catch you guys in just a sec. So once Winscribe gets launched, simply sign in once again so now from over here click on don't show the other again and click on this check button now once you do that after that from the top left you can actually create a new scribe which is basically a fancy way of saying that you can start from scratch or you can basically use their online scribes so i'm gonna click on their online scribes for now so that you could see like all the different options you have now i believe that they don't give you access to all those online scribes in their free trial version so i'm gonna click on create a new scribe and now we can just simply like you know get started so now i'm gonna basically like you know take the background option and i can like you know change it to something else and then i can basically add music as well and then if i were to like you know click on play we need to basically add images or text on our particular canvas so if i were to click on the bottom right where it says add new text i'm gonna simply type in over here hi i'm the capitalist now once i type in that after that i can simply like you know add fonts change the current font to something else or click on done and once i do this i'm gonna like basically increase the size and now i'm gonna click on play so once i click on play it is gonna take a couple of seconds but now i have this video in front of us so like this looks super nice now if i were to like you know decrease the scale a bit i can simply click on this play button and then after that wait for a couple of seconds and then similarly we have ourselves a scribe now we're gonna take it to another level by simply adding more images so i'm gonna like click on the bottom right where it says add new image and once i click on add new image i'm gonna basically wait for a couple of seconds and this is gonna basically load up its own library now you can either choose images from their library or you can simply like you know upload your own images from your own computer or your phone or however you please it is that simple so now from over here you can basically choose from their vast library of images now we have characters we have charts we have a education, famous people, food and drink, geography, health, Hebrew, history, and so many more options. Now I'm going to simply choose buildings from over here and then from the right side I can simply choose any buildings. So I'm going to choose this particular building over here and then if I were to like you know place it over here then I think this looks really really nice because this goes really well with the overall capitalist theme because we have dollars, we have the state bank, so like honestly very very capitalist like and truly my taste so now from over here i want you to click on the bottom right once again so i'm gonna click on the bottom right once again and i'm gonna click on add new image and then i'm gonna basically like add a person so i'm gonna add this particular guy now this is basically a kid so i'm gonna basically try to like you know just simply move this text a bit up because like it doesn't look really nice right now yeah so like i'm gonna do that and then we have this particular and we have this kid over here so basically this is gonna be um that the kid has won a lot of money so we are gonna like basically try to do that i'm gonna add some dollars i'm gonna try to add some good dollars um let's see what we have over here in the library so we have this i'm gonna like you know decrease the size place it over here and then i can add some more stuff over here too so for that what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna basically add in a celebration option so i'm gonna basically like you know choose a celebration box from over here basically something cheerful something which the kid can actually like you know do so i'm gonna like basically have these glasses over here or uh maybe over here yeah so like these are gonna look really cool because these fit perfectly in his hands so i'm gonna do that and now i'm gonna basically like you know put in a man in a suit over here as well so i'm gonna basically just scroll down and find a man in a suit 
So I'm going to type in sudo over here. I'm going to press enter and then let's see what they show us. So like once I press enter, it is going to find the images according to this particular keyword. And then we will see all the people in the suit. So like this one fits perfectly. The guy in the black suit with the black briefcase. So I'm going to choose this one. And now this basically symbolizes that the economy has won and the rich elite, they are leaving the country. So like this looks super nice. I might as well use it for my own cell. So I'm going to click on the top right and play this so that you guys could see what this is actually about. So like once we do this, then we have more text coming in. Basically, this is going to be the kid that we just used. So after that, like just wait for a couple of seconds, like slowly the story is going to progress. So we have this over here too. Now we have the money sack and then we basically have the glasses and then another glass and then we're gonna have the state bank come up so like this looks so nice and honestly for just like three minutes of work this is superb like i'm not even kidding this is so so good so like once we have done this now we will see the whole picture so like alas we have the men in the suit basically bankrupt sad and going home so like all that is done and there we go there is our image and this looks absolutely wonderful so now what i want you to do is that i want you to like you know simply save it if you are happy with this or add in music by simply clicking on the top music icon and then once you click on this particular icon simply choose any one of these options so like i'm gonna play this music so like that was nice now I can simply add this music if I wanted to. I'm gonna add this music and then I'm gonna basically play this music once again for you guys to show you how the video looks now because at the end it is all about making super cool videos. So like that is gonna take a while so I'm gonna skip that but guys now you know basically how video scribe basically works. Now if you were to like you know compare it with basically video scribe well now if you were to like you know compare it with doodly on the other hand well guys it is very very similar i mean honestly if you ask me personally this was far easier to work with than compared to doodly but the thing is the main thing that matters is the pricing so so i'm going to open up both of their prices right now so we can compare better which is the best deal so we have the monthly plan for video scribe charging us 17 dollars per month then we have their yearly plan which if you were to like you know pay at once which is going to be 96 dollars is going to be eight dollars per month which is almost half the price then we have their quarterly plan as well then we have the pricing of doodly so let's go over to doodly and doodly has just two options the standard one is 39 dollars per month with 69 dollars per month being the enterprise options and then they have the following limitations basically nothing is going to be unlimited there are always going to be limitations with doodly whereas on the other hand on video scribe there are no limitations as long as if you pay this fee you can do as much videos as you want as many videos as you want and also like you know use as many characters and as many things that you want you are not going to be running out of things anytime soon so like again the main question was which one is better well guys honestly if you don't want to learn well video scribe is the best option but if you have some passion to learn, well, then Doodly is the best because Doodly has more features as compared to VideoScribe. Because like VideoScribe is super simple, but like the features are, are a bit limiting. Whereas on the other hand, Doodly, well, Doodly is literally gonna like, you know, just let you make whatever you want, like no limitations whatsoever. So like guys, this was basically the comparison and I think I covered everything. If you want to learn more, simply comment down below and I will be sure to answer all your queries. So guys, this was the video and if this video helped you out, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe. Until next time, goodbye.